Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are talking about Robert Whitaker versus Paulo Costa. Robert Whitaker, 24 wins, 7 losses, 3-2 and two in his last 5 fights, 1-2 and two in his last 3. Minus 220 favorite, 33 years old, 6 foot tall, with a 73 and a half inch reach. Paulo Costa, 14-2, and 3-2 two, and two in his last 5 fights, plus 180 underdog. 32 years old, 6'1 with a 72 inch reach, 1 inch taller for Paulo Costa, 1.5 inch reach advantage for Robert the Reaper Whitaker. Now, 24 wins for Robert Whitaker. You know, he has 14 finishes. Now, he's been finished 4 of 7 losses, 3 TKO or KO in, in the UFC. That's interesting. 15 and 5 in the, in the UFC as a whole. It's a very interesting, what? Very interesting uh, fight because I didn't think he had lost before the UFC. Very confusing. Okay, whatever. I'm just taken back because I didn't know he had lost before that. Anyways, doesn't matter. Uh, <clears throat> um, and this matchup with Paulo Costa is which version of Paulo Costa are we getting? It's very interesting because Paul Costa the fought Luke Rockhold. I think uh, Robert Whitaker does a lot of good work against that that uh, Ra uh, Paul Costa. You know, you look at it. Average fight times: Robert Whitaker fourteen minutes, ten forty. Uh, strikes landed per minute four point four seven to six point five. Striking accuracy is forty two to sixty. Strikes absorbed per minute three point three nine to six point three eight. Crazy. Defense 60 to 47. So we know uh, Costa, Costa will be there to be hit. The biggest thing is takedown defense is 82 to 79. Robert Whitaker is very good at defending the takedowns. I am Paulo Costa doesn't really go for him. Takedown accuracy is 75%. I'd assume he's going to go for a couple of takedowns in this matchup just to uh, show something else in the fight. Uh, and again, it's a weird matchup because you have a guy like Paulo who has pretty good power had decent cardio for a while there um and Whitaker who's fa gonna be faster uh I don't know pressure wise Paulo Costa is pretty crazy but um let's see where does it tell us where he's no it does not I was hoping it would say where he's best at least distance wise or whatever but it doesn't matter I I Again, this is another one where I think the heart says Robert Whitaker because I think his determination can get this fight done just by wanting it a little bit more. But I think the power of Paulo Costa might be an issue. I think the pressure from Paulo Costa might also be an issue. I just think that constant in your face, making it ugly, being okay with being hit. I don't know if Robert Whitaker is going to be okay with getting hit by Paulo Costa. Just my opinion. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. As always, peace.